Welcome to our final newsletter for 2020. I would like to thank our 2020 junior school captains, Charlotte and Sam, for the amazing job they've done leading our junior school during a really tough year. They've been excellent role models for all of our students and have contributed to lifting our spirits with their consistent positive attitudes. Charlotte and Sam have had to do their job very differently this year. However, they've been brilliant in adjusting to online presentations and anything else we've asked of them. We wish them the very best for the future. The middle school is very lucky. Well done to all of our Year 3 students who are currently putting effort into their applications to lead our junior school in 2021. We're really looking forward to hearing their thoughts and ideas. It will once again be a very difficult decision for us to make. Our staff are very busy finalising reports, which will be made available in the last week of term. The Department of Education has recently adjusted the expectations around student reporting for semester two in recognition of the continued disruption caused by COVID-19. This means that reports will look a little different when you receive them at the end of term. If your child remains at the same level over this period of time, please don't be alarmed. Our teachers have spent time allowing your child to consolidate and revise their learning in preparation for a strong learning foundation in 2021. Teachers have been informally assessing your child's progress and will continue to identify areas of growth, challenge and improvement. This information will be passed on to your child's teacher for next year. On Wednesday the 9th of December, we're holding our 2021 Year 1 to 9 Meet the Teacher Day. Whilst every attempt will be made to match student and parent preferences, there is no guarantee that all requests will be met. It's our priority to create balanced classrooms where students will work well together and the primary emphasis being on improving learning outcomes for all students. On Friday the 11th of December, we'll acknowledge our Year 4 students' junior school journey with our Moving to Middle School celebration. This group of students have consistently displayed our college values in their learning and their interaction within our community. We're very proud of our Year 4s who have been wonderful role models to our younger students. Thank you to our brilliant Year 4 team of teachers and the instructional leader Dave Roberts for giving our students a fantastic year and what I am sure will be a beautiful send off. I wish our students the very best in their continued journey through our college. On Thursday the 3rd of December, we will be holding our annual giving day, which will be a little different again this year. Students may come in casual clothing and support families in need by donating a gold coin to contribute to vouchers being organised by Terry and Carmel from St Vincent de Paul. Thank you for your support of this wonderful organisation. 2020 has been a very challenging year, with many special events having to be modified or cancelled due to COVID restrictions. I would like to take this opportunity to thank our staff for their hard work and dedication to each and every one of their students. They had to switch to remote learning with very little preparation and they continue to do their very best to support all of their students and families. I'm extremely proud to be part of this special group of educators. They deserve a relaxing holiday to fuel up ready for another great year in 2021. Thank you to all of our parents and carers for the way in which you embraced remote learning this year and worked in partnership with us to continue the teaching and learning of our children. We look forward to working with you next year, hopefully without any remote learning having to occur. Lastly, thank you to our students who've been so resilient and continue to come to school with big, beautiful smiles for their teachers. It's an absolute privilege to come to work every day and be surrounded by such enthusiasm. I would like to wish our Hazel Glen community a very Merry Christmas. Enjoy the holidays and please stay safe. We'll see you next year. Bye for now.